behind me is one of many Roman ruins. You can't really see it. I'm going to give you better, better view of that a little bit later. You can look around me. You can look at the trees here. Uh, here we have olive trees. We're in a Bedouin tent that's absolutely magnificent. Check out the olive trees right here. Let's come on, Lars, come on this way. And uh, we got pomegranate trees right there. This is out in the middle of the desert, probably about 300 miles, or not 300 miles, but 300 kilometers away from Damascus. It took four hours to get here. And uh, right here we have date palm trees. So these date palms, all you have to do is you grab a, a small branch, one of these small branches off of this bigger thing, and you can uh, literally pick a date palm off and munch on it. And it's so good. I mean, this place is like heaven. That's our tent here, guys. Come on. Guys, guys. So, uh, I don't know how much you guys are going to see in here because we just don't have the light, but it's actually really beautiful. Take mama face, no mama. Take mama. Mechanic mama. Mama. Yes. Mama. Yes. Yes. Take her mama. And. Mama, we've got a dress here, a Bedouin dress. Uh, um, is it coming through? Yeah. Okay. Um, so, you know, this is where we're staying for the night. You know, you guys know how much it costs to get out here? It cost $4 for the bus. It cost $2.50 to stay here for the night. And we shared a $2 cab ride that we were haggling over, believe it or not. We ended up paying his original price because I just said, guys, if somebody wants to cheat me out of 33 cents, I'm going to let them. But it's just the case that this place is awesome. You got nothing to fear in Syria. Uh, it's a great place. And I'm going to show you guys more a little bit later.